Hello guys. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. So uh, before proceeding further uh, in interview questions, right? So we are going to start new batch on November 25th. If you are willing to join, please let us know by pinging me in WhatsApp. Okay. So let's get into the question. So the question is, today we are going to discuss about the LTA my entry questions. So going further, what I have done from user's perspective, subscribers, a lot of people are asked. So today I'm going to uh, today I'm going to discuss about the one of the SQL questions which they have asked in a LTA my entry. So one of the subscriber has provided multiple companies interviews. So I'll go ahead and I'll discuss about it. So the question is okay. Let me get into the question. The question here, if you observe right, so they wanted you to uh, they want they wanted to understand how well you write the SQL. Okay. How well you can validate by writing the SQL. See here in the source, we have a ID column, tar country column and target. We have a ID column as well as nothing but a that code, country code for telephone number. India starts with 91 and when it comes to uh, third, okay, US starts with 71. Just assume that. Okay. Let's not go with the real time. So considering this, right? So they have given a logic as well. This is the source details. This is the target details. Consider it is a mapping document. You have a two columns in the source and two columns in the target. But they wanted to go with the with the below logic. If you see, right, what they have mentioned, when the country in source code source is okay, in so the country value is IND, then the value in the target, nothing but in target code should be nine one. And at the same time, next condition is when the country in source, source, okay, USA, then value should be 71. For other countries, you should populate 00. zero. But have you observed one thing? Okay, how they are going ahead and how they wanted to bluff you. Okay, so they have given two, three conditions. Okay, one is if it is India, just go ahead and populate as 91. If it is the US, populate as a 71. But what about... What about other countries? Populate as 00. But have you observed this data properly? So if you observe right, this is bluff, right? So whether your, anal your analyzation skills, your analytical skill is proper or not, they wanted to check. Being an ATL tester, you have to understand the data. Then on top of it, you have to ask the question. So, so here they made you to think of it. Okay. That is the reason they have given 22. But as per logic, okay, as per logic, what you have to do? It should populate as zero. It should populate as zero. That is what they are mentioning. It should populate as zero. But here, what is happening? Here you see there is a discrepancy. Now, how you how can you validate this? How can you validate this? Let's understand. Okay, first we'll prepare the source data. Then how we can do the minus query? How, how we can do the minus query? So here. Try to understand this. Okay. First, we'll have a I have prepared the data here in the source table. Just I have created source table, SID number, and country. Okay. These two columns and with the data types and data type length. So I have created as well as I have even inserted the data, whatever the data which they have given. Okay. Now you can go ahead and query here. Okay. Now you can go ahead and query here. So stable is having five rows, two rows with one, two is with in India and third row is USA and fourth row is Canada and four, fifth row is with Bangladesh, Bangladesh. So now, now what you, you have to do it to validate it, right? First, whenever you have a mapping document, consider it as a small mapping document. It's a prototype mapping document. When you have a logic, this is considered as a transformation logic, transformation logic. Simply what they want you to do it, write a SQL query for this, how you, same way you have to populate it. But here you have to populate it as a zero, not 22, not 22. So to do this, right, what you have to do, simply you have to prepare the SQL query, SQL query at source side based on, based on with this particular logic. See, try to create it up. First, what do you want? Let's go with the simple way. Select. So select. Select. Okay. Let's go. Let's select 
two columns SID, comma, country, country. Okay. Then what is the next thing you wanted to do it? What is the next thing you have to do? You have to write the based on the if else conditions. Case when, okay, case when country code equals to country code equals to IND, IND, then populate as 91, 91. Again, when condition, when country equals to USA, USA, then populate as 71. Yes. Okay. Here, why I'm passing as a else? What they have mentioned? If condition is, if the source in country code, if the value is IND, then populate as 91. If the USA, then populate as 71. If other than this, in the logic, if other than this, populate as 00. Then what I'm going to do here? Just else condition, I'm populating as 0. And I'm mentioning end as as code as code from which table source table source table source table if you see here we are going to get that now you can see right ind wherever ind is there 91 wherever usa is there 71 wherever other than ind and usa we are seeing the zero so now you what you can do simply with this you are going to do the minus okay so here you have to remove this particular thing you here you have to remove this particular country because country is not present in the target so minus select okay s yes, dot id okay s yes, dot id then code okay code from from target table target table so we have not created target table so that is the reason i am not going to execute this query say sim Simply what they have done, using this logic, they have created this particular code column, code column. So you have to prepare at source side, you have to prepare like this. And that's it for the day. And November 25th, we are going to start new ETL testing batch. If you, ha if you have any friends and colleagues who, who wanted to make a career in ETL testing, please let us know. We'll help them. Thank you, guys. Have a great day. ahead.